may have noticed that I have handed out little strips of paper to you. What we're going to do is, um, actually this is a real labor rally, and during labor rallies, people aren't sitting quietly. They're not sitting quietly, and they're not waiting for their turn to speak. They are passionate, they are speaking out. So throughout the labor presentations today, feel free to speak out and challenge during discussion, during presentations. Thank you. Good day to you all. I'm Big Bill Haywood, and I'm here to talk to you about labor today. It is with great gratitude and pleasure that I stand here among you at this historic gathering. As a society, we cannot stand for this injustice and exploitation. You talk about strikes, and you talk about this wonderful economic, uh, this wonderful world of economic justice. How? What is between those two places? You're going for like going on strikes and making sure that children are represented so they're not used on manual labor. Do your views align with anarchy, basically? I'm There's a strong distinction between expressing socialist values and expressing values yeah. of anarchy. I'm just wondering. I mean, socialist values are operating within mm -hmm. our political system. Yeah, and if anything, I would critique you guys for being too focused on using the systems of power that uphold inequality in creating this revolution. I mean, if you want to make real change, you kind of have to work within the structure that we have right now. So Why? it's the difference between you and the suffragettes. Okay, but if the you... suffragettes could be considered one small part of our organization or our movement because they're only one step in it.